Rhino Rescue 350 piece first aid kit. Stick around. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to Three River Survival. So, this is Rhino Rescue's 350 piece OSHA certified first aid kit. All right, comes with a handle. It's got some things on the back so you can hang it up. If you're not really sure what OSHA is for, it is like the safety union or safety police. Certain jobs require that you have a certain amount of eight, uh, safety protocols and or safety equipment on site in case somebody gets hurt. So fire extinguishers, first aid kits, um, that kind of thing. So what Rhino Rescue did is they put this kit together and they wanted me to check it out. Uh, it does have a lot of equipment in it, so I'm going to drop to make sure that you guys can take a good look at this if you want it. It's about $45 on Amazon, and I think they have a 10% discount code, so I'll drop the links down below if you're interested in this. Uh, it does have uh, a lot of bandages and boo-boo ouch stuff. Um, it's not necessarily a trauma kit. It does have some stuff, but it's it's okay. You know what I mean? It's, it's basically for home office, that type of stuff. You know, if you work in an industrial or if you work in a, um, factory, this will definitely do you good. You don't have to worry about it. Just buy this one kit and you are fine. So a couple things I want to get to before we do all this, I, I'll just read the contents down below so you can see, uh, once we get into it, three by three and a quarter, 70 adhesive bandages, 70. That's a lot. Uh, three by an inch, 50. Knuckle bandages, you got 20. Fingertip bandages, 20. Waterproof bandages, 10. Spot waterproof bandage, uh, one by a 10, 10 inches is 10. Butterfly closure, 10. Two by two gauze, four. Four by four gauze, four. Triangle bandages with safety pin, one. PTB bandages, that's a three by five yard, that's two. Abdominal pad, five by nine, one. iPad, one. Um, you also have some essentials like safety pins, bandage scissors, nitride gloves, tape, scissor, first aid guide, because you might not know what you're doing. Uh, cleanup, alcohol pads, antiseptic wipes, soap wipes, cotton swabs, 40. Um, treatments, you got burn treatments, two. You got sting relief pads, 10. CPR mask with one-way valve. You have one instant cold pack, that's one. Tourniquet, one and a tongue depressor five, all right? So protect, clean, treat, and essential. So that's all it is. It's really just a very large boo-boo kit for multiple people if you need it. All right, so let me drop the camera and uh, we'll open this sucker up. It just comes in this vacuum seal. Uh, what I like about it already, it does have a locking suitcase. It also has holes if you want to you know, lock it for some reason. Uh, it does have a rubber gasket around the side, which is nice to keep it semi-waterproof. And you can hold this or you can hang it up. Uh, like I said, on the back of this, let me close this up first. On the back of it, it does have these little hook holes. So if you want to screw it into the wall, which is nice. And then this becomes your whole first aid cabinet. And like I said, it also has a handle. So if you don't want to do that, that's fine. Just make sure everybody knows where it is. So it comes out like this in this really nice tray. It does have an opening. So if you wanted to, you can open it up and it has a secondary shelf. Okay. So that's kind of neat as well. Some things kind of fell around in here. Obviously, once you put it in place, it's not going to be that much of a big deal. But some stuff will fall out because I have it in this downward position. All right, some cool features, like I said. So you do have your antiseptic wipes up here, multiples. Uh, and what's cool about this is, I don't know if you could see that, but it actually flips forward a little bit. So if you wanted to flip these forward, you could, which is nice, and you can get in there and get your nitride gloves, antiseptic wipes. Again, there's multiples in here, and obviously these are all refills. Uh, you also have some soap wipes in here, and again, these two top trays are small enough that you could put small items in it, which is nice. I don't think the bottom trays flip down, but this is the Rhino Rescue Tourniquet, I believe, that you're talking about. Again, it's not a, um, it's going to be more of a hospital tourniquet. You have two tapes, all right? So small enough, but it will work. You also have in here some Q-tips. 
Again, Q-tips to get into those small areas. And I do believe, yep, this is a CPR valve, all right? Again, multiple Band-Aids, all different sizes. They fit in here very, very neatly. Again, some of this stuff kind of fell out, which I, I can imagine, uh, because although it has a nice setup, it's not 100%, all right? It's just not. It's just not going to fit that way. But it does give you enough stuff to, if you wanted to hang it up, it's not going to fall out on you. So that's kind of neat as well. All right, so let's go over to the second. There we go. Let's go over the stage of this, which is kind of nice. Again, some of the stuff might have fell out, like the burn gel, but it's in there. You do have some scissors, some shears, which is nice. Triangle bandage. You also have a um, splinter, ice pack. Again, for your other needs, for your um, safety pins if you need it. That's all in there. Your first aid manual is going to be nice and thin. All right, just basics. All right, you should know first aid to begin with, but again, I know not everybody studies up on it, but you probably should. Tongue depressors, all right, if you needed it, it's in there. Some two by twos, you do have an eye patch, all right, a lot of times people get hurt. Um, get poked in the eye, multiple four by fours, and again, your elastic bandages. All right. So again, really nice setup. Uh, I do like the fact that it is waterproof. Okay. You could also stuff a bunch of stuff in here. I mean, this is, this is like 350 pieces. We all know 350 pieces is mostly the small band-aids, but the fact that you can hang it up and the stuff doesn't fall out because it's that shelving and you also have a secondary shelf is kind of nice in a semi-waterproof box. Um, I'm a big fan of that. I think that's kind of neat. It also has a locking box. So again, really nice setup. And I think for 45 bucks, this is what you want in your home um, or your workshop or something like that. It's quick. It's quick to access the bandages if you need them. Uh, the tape's right there. If you need to get more heavier stuff, you go to the second level. Uh, really like it. And it's pro obviously, if it's waterproof, it's probably dustproof. So I'm pretty sure that you could uh, put this in any workshop and be fine with it. Let's go back up top. All right, guys, there you have it. This is the 350-piece OSHA certified first aid kit. Uh, by Rhino Rescue. I showed you all the pieces for 45 bucks plus 10% off. You really can't go wrong. I'll put all the links down below. Please like and subscribe, guys. It really does help the algorithms. If you have this kit or have anything that you want to say, just put it on down below. If you want to support this channel, it's very simple. All you have to do is go to Patreon. You could pay $1 a month and watch videos like this before anybody else. Or you could use the links that I provide down below. I am an Amazon affiliate. I think I get like two cents on a dollar. So thank you very much. Hope your Father's Day was great. Thank you very much, guys. And as always, stay safe.